hi everyone welcome back again to another flutter tutorial and in this video we will be dealing with the basic stylings what we can apply for the text form fields in flutter here we got a handful of uh, text form styles what i have just already applied totally we have five stylings i have just applied over there and i will just walk you through the basic stylings what i have applied and what are the benefits and where to apply those okay so starting with the first uh, this is a simple text form field where I haven't applied any stylings except for the colors and I haven't provided any borders or fill colors. So actually it uh, just appears like a simple text widget but only when you tap on that you can see that it is a text form field. Okay. So this is a uh, basic text form field without any styling and moving to the next text form field where I have just applied the border styling alone and more specifically I have just set the border as underline border so you get you can see that there is an underline below that text form field okay so this is the second styling what you can have for your text form field and moving to the third is uh, here I haven't applied any stylings for the border and I haven't set any border as well but rather I have just provided the fill color just to distinguish that it is a text form field okay so the border uh, is actually none but the fill color i have provided to make it visible to the users that it is a text form field and moving to the fourth so the fourth text form field is actually the combination of second and third i have just combined the underlying border as well as the fill color so if you tap on that you can just enter the input data okay and moving to the fourth is what i have applied the border stylings on all sides right and if the user taps over that text form field you can see that the label text actually moves up so but rather in case of the tail third text form field what you see here if you just tap on that and if you start entering the hint text actually disappears but it is not the case in the fifth text form field if the label text actually moves up even if you just start typing anything so this is another kind of stylings what you can have for your text form field okay so these are all the basic stylings what you can apply for your text form field and let's move on to the coding part to know how to implement this individual text form fields one by one